Welcome back to more Lord of the Rings Online. I'm Salty Kerr, and we're continuing our adventure all the way through Lotro, from beginning to end, and every quest in between. Um, so as promised, we're going to start up today with some of our skirmishes that we haven't done yet, and, and enjoy those. Uh, let's start by opening our Hobbit gift for today. See what pops out. Oh, those are always good. The only problem is with those ones, if they don't you can't really stack them. It doesn't let you stack them. So they end up just taking space in your bag. So I think we can combine those together. Um, oh, and I should have sold. Should have sold because we're going to be getting lots of junk. So why don't we head over and uh, over here to Bree and do some selling of stuff and then return and we're going to level up a bit our skirmish soldier what do you need so i don't think there's anything we're going to keep here um, the person making a lot of noise back there we'll keep those stews even though they weren't all that great, we realized. Get our fancy schmancy bow going. Um, yeah, no, this was any, any of an upgrade. Yeah. Calfer's glory. That's not an upgrade. Uh, we do want to keep the Levithron wood. Sell all this other stuff. So we will sell. We got quite a bit of gold there. We all this stuff we can. Uh, this we can hit Alt and right click, and then we can make them all go at once. So we got that much reputation for the Matham Society. So if we check our rep here, we're still merely an acquaintance. We are known to the Matham Society. I guess we weren't even known yet. So now we are known. Completed the deed. Which did not... I don't, I don't think that got us any... Any virtue experience. <laughs> Double check here. Yeah, so we're still earning out of 15... Okay, so if we remember our skirmish, what do you need? Warrior, or uh, our skirmish soldier is an herbalist, so uh, we can level her up a bit. Okay, so um, that's level 37. I don't know why that attribute is red. But, I mean, let's level up to like. 47 for now and for our skills we will now be able to we have to close this and we're going to open this one what can I do we will for now you? be able to put two skills in so um, we'll get the big heal which is this one refreshing herbs and then we'll get the heal that is um, uh, the heal over time so that's power. This one is defense increase. So we're going to put nature's cure, which is medium ah. healing over time. Um, I don't think we're eligible yet to get the, the biggest healing over time. But she's level 8 now. Um, I'm trying to think here how to... I think it goes by the attribute level that's underneath there. So, like, she's for she's for a level 45 character. And we, as you see, are level 31. I better put the XP and disabler in as we're here. Um, what so, can I let do for you? us open up the herbalist in the skill. And nature's cure is the one, but refreshing herbs. So, let's get that up quite a ways. So what is that, 51? I'll do this one too, get it the same. Try to level. 
doesn't look the same. And the attribute, what was our attribute? 47, 49. There we go. So 51. So we'll be good for a while on those on those skills. So let's go trade them. Greetings. So let's put nature's cure in there. That's our healing medium over time. And see if that makes a difference. The rest of the oh, did we want to increase our training and our personal? Let's do that too. Um, so we'll confirm that one. We'll jump back over here to training. Uh, and we had slotted. Um, what did we have slotted? What oh, do I you need? Both of them. That's nice. A lot of times you can't open more than one dialogue box at a time. So we decided we were going to go with tactical mastery, so that we'll heal for greater amounts and more critical heals. So, Tactical Potency and Practiced Critical. So, Tactical Potency was... There was Tactical Potency. There it is. So, let's level that one up quite a bit. 151. And then the other one was... Practiced Critical. So, we'll get that one up as well. <laughs> Okay, good. Now our personal skill was tactical artistry, so that our outgoing healing increases from our person. So, tactical artistry. So let's go ahead and bring that one. She doesn't have much survivability though, but we'll see how that goes. Okay. So. Those are all at 10, so we're 10s across the board. All right, so now we just have to determine what skirmish we want to go into here. So we'll just open our instance finder, go down to our skirmishes, and we've got six to choose from. We did the um, trouble at Tuckboro, uh, but we haven't done any of the others. So, it's been a long, long time since I've done any of these. Um, let us see if we can... We did Thiever in Mischief last time. And Trouble in... Did we do Trouble in Tuckboro? Yes, we did Thiever in Mischief. That was the one here in Bree. Then we did Trouble in Tuckboro. So there's four that we can do here. So let's, let's start with an offensive one, just for fun. So we'll go with Attack at Dawn. I remember nothing of this one. Um, but let's see what tier 3 does to us at level 31. This is going to lead us into trouble and mayhem. We get 124% of the marks. So let's go ahead and do it. Now people will say do tier 1 because it's easier and be more successful. But... Um, Rolls and Dole Divin. Yeah, we haven't even discovered this area yet, so this is all uh, further on in the game. Um, I wonder if I should be selecting things that we haven't discovered yet, but I don't think we've discovered most of these areas. She's going to town right now on us. Um, okay. So we got our run speed buff. Not that, we're not really getting stuff here, but we'll take our names off. Okay, we have to secure the main gate. We've got a zealot of pain. Sorry about the heart seeker. Okay, let me fear this one. Zealot pain first. We gotta be really good about pulling the aggro off of her. Ooh, she's getting plunked from someone. Oh, it's this guy. Uh, so we better pull that archer off. 
trying to grab this person here. Oh, she has a poison arrow on her. So, so the hunter can use his purge poison off of off of allies as well. Okay, so I'm hoping our power doesn't become an issue. Alright. So we can hit that one. If they're gonna bring bring these other people, so let's see. Let's try to fear the troll or terrify the troll. Oh, if it didn't go, the frickin' the frickin' cursor issue. Oh, it drives me crazy. Okay, we can also start using it. Ah! So we're gonna back out here so it doesn't knock us into other aggro. We're going to try to pull him away because the troll has aggro that gets to the front. So if we were, let's say we were here and he was hitting us, he'd also be hitting our, our heal me damn it. That happen. Okay. Okay. These are like instances so the enemies don't respawn. So there's no need to 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 really rush too much. Okay, might as well eat here. We did not get a counterattack. That's nice. All right, I can't remember where to go in here. Um, I don't think it's this way, but I think we need to kill these things nonetheless. So I'm going to throw down a trap. And we're going to pull this guy. I'm going to make sure that we're pulling this river off of her. Trap is doing a job over there. I'm gonna make sure it stays there until we're done. Reaver Slayer, that guy was tough. And now we're ready for this week of Shadow Star. Okay. So we're gonna get a whole bunch of deeds here. Um, because this is our first time through and we're facing these enemies for the first time. Until secure the western gate or secure the eastern gate. Interesting. I don't remember there being a choice, but they might have changed things. We have acquired the heavy iron collar. I don't know what that is. It starts the quest. Let's see. Using that has no effect. We're not going to be uh, getting too much in the area of rewards for skirmishes. So as you notice there, there was that red square, uh, or red circle. That's indicating where the catapult rock is going to land. So it kind of gives you a heads up so you can get out of that area. So you can't just park it in an area. So we're just going to come in. And another reason is great choosing the hunter is we don't have to run all the way up there. We can just go to us. Kind of stay safe. And put terror into that guy. And he resisted. And I think they get hit with the with the rock as well. Okay, that's only five minute food. I might eat the 15 minute food even though the region is less. It'll last longer. Um, and remember we took the squares off. So, just like in the middle of squares, these circles. Here. Try 
afraid I have to get hit by stuff. I don't know, they're standing right there. Let's see if they get hit. They did not get hit. So, oh yeah, I did. Look, you got a little bit of a little bit of a hit there. This is my sidestep issue. Just to get the proper skill. I did not really need to use my arts arrow, but it worked. Is going to come from after hitting this. Here's a counter attack. Um, I don't know if this is a safe spot here or if it's just going to get us back. Okay, so this is going to be a little bit tricky. So there's going to be a lot of them. We're going to get that power out of the way for sure. Poison arrow over there. Feel me down. Hit by this nonsense. Okay. Alright. Oh, we don't have the terror ready yet. Now we do so we get rid of him for Gotta get this goo off. Shepherd of Phil. Zimarp has arrived to retake the Western Gates. Okay, so there's another counterattack. I wonder how we get this on. It stays, I guess. Lieutenant of the enemy has joined the battle. Oh, there they are. Okay, now sometimes you can you can, like we're doing right here, they run to the flag, so if you come off of the flag, oh, these things are the worst. You gotta kill blood rooks. Gotta kill blood rooks. Blood rooks are off. Yeah, we also gotta take care of heal me damage. Yep, she went down. The blood wrecks are terrible. You get in with their cloud and just water. And they are so hard to fight. So strong. Thought I hit that. That was close. Has arrived on the eastern flank to reinforce the courtyard. This was the courtyard. So this would be the eastern flank, right? Is that him here? Yes. They used to have a special flag for the encounters. Uh, so you knew where they were, but I guess they decided they weren't going to do that anymore. Uh, in completely the wrong area. Where are you, Pew? Uh, if you do the encounters, you also get um, banners that you can use in in the fights. Okay, so he's in there. here. He is. Okay, so he's pretty 
quite big. We've got some power to him, so we're going to go ahead and hit him with that, and then we're going to pin him. He's resisting all of our stuff. Let's turn him around. Holy mackerel, he's stuttering. So and the encounters are no joke. them down. Cut them down. Low cut. We're almost there for that one too. That's neat. Well, that'll be done here. Deed completed. Critical hits with our bow skills. Sweet. So you'll notice we got this. So what that does is it allows us to throw this down in the middle of a battle and it gives us, uh, what does this one do? Uttermost Emblem of the West. Duration 20 seconds. There is an item of power. Granted, the elves second use this item will grant you a bonus to melee range or tactical defenses for a short time. It'll put down a circle like that, and then you can stay in the circle. Okay, so that was kind of that was kind of rough. We're gonna have to give her a better name than Heal Me, damn it. Towerhead Kegmaster. Filers. And a bow. Is that a, no, he doesn't have a bow. He has an axe. Okay, that's okay. We'll put down a trap here. I don't know if we can actually... Yeah, he's not in our line of sight yet. So we'll start by throwing him. Burn. That's not the one I want. There's that mouse thing again. Okay, let's get this berserker out of the way. You take his range tips. He doesn't hit too hard. by beer that was thrown at you. Be careful, you are drunk. Wow, I didn't even know that was a thing. Alright, so since we're drunk, and that is quite a... It's quite a hit we're taking there. Alright, let's rename her. Um, Luthien seems a little bit cliche, but that's all that's coming to mind right now. letting you take names from the story. Well, you know what? We are going to do a workaround. Luthien. Wow, they're even doing that? Um, Alright. Um, mm, mm, oh. Figure something out sometime. Okay, let's let's just keep on going here. Okay. And no, no counter attack. That's good.
to get into the habit of using this uh, merciful strike, the merciful shot. Because look, that just hit for 1454. It is a great brutal skill that we will trade all the way up um, if we look at our traits here. Uh, so merciful shot will start to get quite a bit bigger. But even that one, we we critted that one, I think. Or did we devastate? Yeah, it was a critical hit. Okay, so now we can get rid of a couple of these catapults. That have been causing such mayhem. Okay, now this part here, like they will all be throwing stuff down. But the boss, I think, I think it's the boss that we need to get. So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to move this diaper, is what people call them, uh, to that. To that one. I'm going to close all the rest of these so that I remember that I have it. Because oftentimes I'll forget. Oh, apparently we haven't done enough to, to do this yet. So there's something else we need to secure. So we're at about a. Oh, we didn't secure this. Uh, we'll secure this, deal with the counterattacks, and then um, cut this episode, and then we'll pick up with the boss fight in the next episode. I had a feeling we weren't going to get away with no counterattack two times in a row on a tier three. So let's scare this guy away. Forceborn Reaver. Oh, he's just running anyway. That's fine. We'll take it. Stay up, my lady. All these guys here. Where that lieutenant went? Wayne. Come, Berserker. that other encounter. I don't think we ever found it, did we? Okay. Hopefully just one phase, yes. Okay, so now we can go into Grog's tent. But we want to find that other encounter because we want to try to do them both but since it's been about a half hour we're going to pause here and we'll pick up next time <laughs>